using doubles to add numbers. This is lesson 1.6. Now, as I told you in the last video, double means two. In addition, a double is two of the same number that we add together. So one plus one would be double ones. Two plus two would be double twos. And three plus three would be double threes. Well, doubles can help us add other facts. If we know that four plus four equals eight, to do four plus five, we know that's just one more. It's just this one more. So the answer, our sum, would be one more than eight. It would be nine. It's just one more than four plus four. See, we just add a one onto it. Eight, nine, because of that extra one. If we have five plus five, we have five. So let's count on. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Five plus five is ten. See, so do you know what five plus six would be? The six is just one more than that five. So our answer, our sum, is going to be one more than 10. It's going to be 11. See how the doubles can help us? Three plus three, we have three, four, five, six. So three plus four, well, that's just one more than three. So we're going to have one more than six. It'll be a seven. See? Four plus four, we have four. Five, six, seven, eight. Four plus four is eight. Four plus five, that's just one more than four, isn't it? So we're just going to add one more to our sum. It's going to be nine. Four plus five is nine. Here we have eight plus eight. That's eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. 8 plus 9, well, that's just one more than that 8. So our sum is going to be one more than 16. It's going to be 17. See? 6 plus 6, we have 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. So 6 plus 7, that's just one more than 6. Our sum is going to be one more than 12. It'll be 13. And doubles can help us. See? 9 plus 9, we have 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. So 10 plus 9 is just one more. So we're going to have one more than 18. We're going to have 19. See? 7 plus 7, we have 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. And 7 plus 8, that's just one more than that 7. So our sum is going to be one more than 14. It's going to be 15. 15. Now let's see if we could do these. We're going to look for a pattern and figure out which fact comes next. We have 2 plus 2. That's an easy one, isn't it? 2 plus 2 is 4. So do you know what 2 plus 3 would be? Because it's one more than that 2. It would be a 5. So you know what 2 plus 4 would be. That's one more than the 3. That would be 6. See how easy this is going to be? Let's see if we can do that with the 3s. 3 plus 3, well, 3, 4, 5, 6. That's a 6. And 3 plus 4 is one more than that 3. So it must be one more than the 6. It must be a 7. So 3 plus 5 must be one more than the 7. It's an 8. See? You can also look at this as 3 plus 5 is 2 more than that 3. A 5 is 2 more than a 3, isn't it? So the answer is going to be 2 more than the 6. Now we're getting ahead, aren't we? <laughs> isn't that tricky? Let's try this one. 4 plus 4. We have 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. 4 plus 5 is just one more than the 4, so the answer, the sum must be one more, so that's a 9. 4 plus 6, that's just one more than the 5, so that must be 10. 6 plus 6, we have 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. 
6 plus 7, that's one more than the 6, so it must be one more in the sum, so it must be 13. 6 plus 8, that's only one more than the 7, so it must be 14. One more than the 13. And 8 is 2 more than 6. So the answer, the sum must be 2 more than 12. See? 7 plus 7, we have 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. 7 plus 8, that's 1 more than the 7, so the answer, the sum must be 1 more than the 14, so it must be 15. 7 plus 9, that's 1 more than 8, so the answer must be 1 more than 15, it must be 16. But 9 is also 2 more than 7, so the answer must be 2 more than 14, so we know it's 16. See? So doubles can help us add. We can do it with 5 plus 5. You know 5 plus 5. That's an easy one, isn't it? It's 10. 5 plus 6 is one more, so it's 11. 5 plus 7 is one more than that, so it's 12. And the 7 is also 2 more than the 5. So the answer must be 2 more than 10. See? It's a 12. That's how we use doubles to add numbers, to help us add other numbers. Okay? So you can think about that when you're trying to add other numbers. Try to see if you can think of some doubles and then go on from there. All right? I'll see you next video. Bye.